I see this helicopter is carrying 100 pound and 120 pound packages. I already feel like it's going to be that type of problem where we might have 100x plus 120y. And let's just finish it out and see what might equal. Uh, they must carry at least 10 packages. Okay, that's different units. These are both in pounds. Uh, and the total weight, here it is, can be at most 1,100 pounds. So this is going to be your classic. If you have three numbers with the same units, this is always going to be your weighted equation, the one with like pounds or dollars or something that you have to derive. And we know it's less than or equal to because it's at most 1,100. And then this kind of discarded number that didn't get used, this is going to be your other total. So they say um, must be at least 10 packages. And then your second equation, I call this the weighted equation because it has your units. Your second equation is always just x plus y with that discarded number that was unused. So really not too bad to get those two equations. Let's throw them in Desmos and see what happens. So we have 100x plus 120y is less than or equal to 1100. And then we have x plus y is greater than or equal to 10. And we're going to want to zoom out and they wanted to know the most or the maximum number of and let's just hide this real quick the max number of 120 pound packages so we want to know the biggest y possible here so remember your double shaded region here is your solution set so i'm going to go ahead and zoom in here and i'm going to try to find the highest i'm thinking just like a vertical bar or a horizontal bar i'm trying to think my highest solution here in my y it looks like it's going to be five here let's double check and make sure that's an answer and it is. It looks like my highest Y or 120 pound packages is going to be C, 5. 